I want to tell you a story. It's good advice that you get from one of your grandfathers when you grow up in South Africa. And it's good advice for you as well, young cowboy. What they say in South Africa is, Maak seker dat jy een meisie krijg wat kan vry. <laughs> Man is makkelijker om haar te leer kook, as om haar te leer na... <laughs> <laughs> I need to translate that, okay? Yeah. Be sure you you find a girl to become your wife one day that knows how to treat you well. Mm. Because it's a lot easier to teach her how to cook than to teach her how to look after your needs. Yeah. <laughs> so so there's a second part of the story that they don't tell you. And that is that yeah, you don't have to teach her how to cook. All you have to do is the day that you get married, make sure that somebody gives her a cook and geniet. There's three cookbooks in the world that matters. There's Escoffier, there's Julia Childs, and then in South Africa we had our very own Tani Inya de Villiers Cook and Geniet. Now I've got the copy that my mom got when she got married 13 months after I was born. Every Afrikaner woman gets one of these when they get married. This is the 1970s version. This is so much part of what an Afrikaner heritage, culture, and life has been about since basically the first print, which was in 1951. Here's the journey I want to take us on this year as two cowboys. People have been following us and asking us what happened to the cowboys. And I want to tell a little bit of that story. Might be boring. You might cut this out. But when we started in practically 2018, we started with a mission and at that time, we still thought we can turn things around in the minds of the people that we find ourselves around amongst in Alberta and Canada. The thinking was to promote people that make things because there's a lot of values that comes with making something. There's ownership, there's community, there's reciprocity. There's a whole lot of values that comes with it. And that journey has taken its course. And sometimes we were completely silly. In other cases, we were not so silly. Sometimes we made it a little bit serious. Other cases, um, not so serious. And we had a lot of people that we worked with. And then the big nasty happened. As everybody knows, the world changed. And I'm not going to go into what, what happened. What I want to say is, Basically, after the last three years and all the, the mess that the world suddenly dumped themselves into, the Cowboys also need to sit back a little and reflect. What is it we really want to communicate? What stories do we still want to tell? Many of the stories we told people are actually not there anymore. Those businesses didn't make it. Safe and effective took them out. They were safe and it was effective. We always said our stories need to be positive. And there were also people that shunned us. It says, you you guys don't fit in. You don't fit in over, over and out. So the big question is what's next for the Cowboys? And it took a while to figure that out. And one of the things I think we want to do is continue entertaining you. But we also want to go on a journey about the real value in life. And we've said that value from the start. The value is not in politics. The real value is really when you sit around a table eating with your family and your friends. And I think that's something that we as a heritage and Afrikaner dom understood well for a long, long time. This is a, a bit of a homage back to where we come from. We're gonna go on this journey. It's it's called the Cook and Geniet journey. We need to translate that. Cook and Geniet, cook and enjoy. But instead of taking every recipe and teaching you how to cook, because I think we're done with that one too. We are going to take you on the journey. And I'm laughing because it's a little naughty as well is, what is the typical journey that young bride needs to go through to discover what it is to look after the food for the family? I remember as a young boy, Sundays after church, coming home and receiving an absolute spread of food. Leg of lamb, roast beef, chicken dinner, millipop, bourrevors, uh, patats, artapols, artapols, potatoes, and, and sweet potatoes, and pumpkin, and, and that was just the main course. There were, there were starters, there was dessert, and, and you would absolutely eat yourself into a coma 
so that by three o'clock all the adults would fall over and they would only awake from a food induced slumber around seven o'clock in the evening just to repeat the whole thing again with leftovers that is what it ultimately ended up being is families together we're going to cook what's in here we're going to tell you what this is about because we've got new media we're going to try and make it as humorous as we can we're still going to talk uh, some of our, 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 our native tongue native language what was are we first nation first as I well i don't know what we are i think we were first where we were last and now we're last where the first came they what whatever the story is in any way we're going to use the language that we were born with and uh, we will also use the english and we're going to take you on our cook and genie journey we're going to source ingredients we have to go find things i mean one of the things we need to do here cowboy i'm not sure if you know that we need to do scalp cop mm, sheep head sheep said lamb said as things usually develop with these journeys and the journey that the young bride has feeding her family, growing up and eventually handing off the cook and geniet to her daughter. This thing gets little tales, it gets extra pieces added to it, recipes that made a difference. And it tells a story of a family. You can see all the food splattering here. We want to involve you in this journey. So the first thing that we are going to ask you to do for us is if you are a young bride or somebody that has a cook and geniet, Tani Anna and Tani Priscilla down South Africa. And there's a particular item in here that you want the cowboys to feature. Why don't you drop it in the comments for us or send us a note or a tweet or a or a IM or a or, or a or a smoke signal or a drum drum beat, but send us your message so that we can feature that dish and what we'll do is we'll credit you with it and we'll tell that particular dish a story and we'd like to know why it's your favorite as well maybe you're part of the story on this very long journey ultimately we want to entertain you this is going to be growth for the cowboys and if we don't grow there's no value in it you can probably pick up the tempo is going to be a little slower uh the journey is going to be beyond just the videos we're on x now as well okay well you know that hey yeah you, you know we're now on x yeah the elon <laughs> elon masters x mustard that means the journey is much more than just the videos we'll be posting our photos we'll be posting our messages we'll be posting where we are uh, and also our disasters and our messes um, and then lastly if you feel like uh making the journey to canada to come and cook with us to come and and uh, and, and visit the cowboys don't be shy that's a long story. Um, I want to finish with this. This is how important the cook and geniet is. And again, I don't want to choke up. I got this from my mom. Probably the last visit she, she's ever going to make in Canada to come and visit us. She said to me, it's time. Um, she betrothed this to me. She says, op my afsterwe, gaan die boek na my enigste bloed sien. I didn't know there were more than one. Hendrik van Wijk, April 2019. So in English, basically what that means is when I move on. This needs to go to my only son, Hendrik van Wijk, on uh, April 2019. And in part, this is paying homage to somebody that invested tremendously in us, in me, and also a young little cowboy here in front of me. And he's shaking the camera now because he's probably feeling the emotion with us. So come with us. Let's cook. Let's enjoy. Let's hold on to the little things in life that still makes an awful lot of sense and bring the people that matters to us close to us.